Hi there and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 2. I'm Baron. In the last video we have escaped from it a dungeon, but Imran has been captured again. Dang it. She was taken away by a few mages. And uh, together with Iranicus, Iranicus, that can't be good, I guess. Lady Bath. So long as you are polite, I <coughs> shall tolerate you. <coughs> Greetings to you. Did you have aught to do with the spectacle that I just witnessed? Hmm? No doubt, more worrying peasants in that guild business. Hmm, of a sort, I suppose. What that wizard I was taking, do you know who he is? I'm afraid not. Anyone who practices magic without a license does it in seclusion. The coward wizard arrests those who don't, such as your mysterious wizard. How one gets a license from the coward wizard to use magic I do not know, although I imagine someone in the government district must. The Coward Wizards? Are they the ones who took Imo and, and the wizard? Where did they go? The girl was a friend of yours? Well, she was a spellcaster, so both she and the other were taken away by the Coward Wizards. Take care, Heavy Chibnomi. I have heard of these Coward Wizards. Spellcasters of, <coughs> spellcasters of the highest order. The only magic users allowed in M, I believe. Undue practice of magic is forbidden here, naturally. Where the wizards would take your friend, however, I do not know. And where might he be? Can you tell me where I am? Ah, I thought you must be outlanders from your accents and garb. Welcome to Athkatla, the city of coin. Uh, Athkatla? Mm. You did mention guilds? Why? Are they as violent as the display here? I'm not as distant from the workings of the city as some nobles might be. I have heard the mutterings of our stable boy and his kin. Thieves rule the night and war against those that would take it from them. It would not be unusual for it to spill unto the day. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. So, luckily that uh, place has already been explored for us, so we will go to the adventurous mod first because we have to uh, check our belongings. Oh yeah, so they've taken Imo away from us. See what we still have our stuff. Uh, then close the distance, my friend. So I guess all the arrows now go to you. And you could take the bow instead of your one. The eagle bow is a plus two bow, so that's probably better than the one you have. <coughs> What's that? A dagger plus one? Oh, we have lots of stuff here that we can sell. So, who are you? I have no patience for Step right up! Our Step right up! Best be a short one. Come, enter the adventurous mart. Behind me you will find all the equipment any adventurer needs. Uh, what do they sell? Weapons, both magical and plain. Stolen armor from the lair of dragons. Scrolls of sorcery. Anything you need, we have. Okay, let's step in here then. Don't even think about trying to steal something. No, me never. Consider it done. I trust all this well. Gareth. Eh? Perhaps your eyes are better than mine. Do you see any salamander dust here? Why not just ask the storekeeper? Oh, what do you need salamander dust for? Hmm, you're not a coward wizard, are you? Hmm, hmm. It's for soup. Yes, that's it. Salamander soup for my uh, children and things. Hmm, do you see it or not? Why not just ask the stop shock? Blah. Storekeeper, if he has any. Ribald, we are not on speaking terms. He tried to charge me three coppers for a bottle of pitch and a clutch of my tails. Outrageous! I won't speak to him until he apologizes. How do you buy anything here then? Very quietly. Now look, is it too much for an old man to ask? Do you see any bloody salamander dust or not? Uh, no, I don't see anything here actually. Titmice and tarnations. I was sure s I saw some here the last time. Did somebody sneeze when I wasn't looking? Uh. 
Okay, who are you? I need a swig of some strong. There be a huge ale. silver sphere that they say appeared in the slums out of nowhere. I did. Did you even go and see it? I had it last week. Huge thing it is. Larger than life and twice as grim. No one knows how to get inside and no one comes out. You were drunk all last week. Well, I still went and seen it. Lost it. I ain't blind. That's not what you said after nine pictures of that turmish whiskey you drank the day before last. Well, I'll be allergic to do allergic to turmish, and besides it has not to do with your Yon, bleh, with yon spear. Okay, there's a three in the slums. Oh yeah, that shall be interesting. Who are you? Ribald Bartman, at your service. Greetings to you, good sir. I trust all is well. It is well enough, Miss Jahira. You're not bring half or trouble to me doorstep, good lady. Might I remind you that my days of involvement with your kind are long over? <coughs> I'm not here. In official capacity, a suspicious one. There is no need to worry. With your kin, there always be a need to worry. But I should mind me manners. Please excuse me. Rival bottomman at your service. My adventure is modest, the finest shopping in all of Ferro. Wide selection, lowest prices, and nary a fancy illustration. Just the goods, fair thing. Um, I was wondering if I could ask you a couple of questions. You certainly can. What's in your mind? A friend of mine has been taken prisoner by the cold wizards. Do you know where she would be kept? Ah, too bad. A friend came in from Riettaven about a year back. A mage named Terse. His mule had gone lame and he'd summoned a floating disc to carry his supplies. They captured him, of course. The earth should have known better. I'm sure he thought a disc was harmless enough, but those wizards are strict about their licenses. I tried looking for him, but the cold wizards aren't easy to find. Nobody knows where they stay here. And they never let out where their magical prison is. It's a travesty that the council gives them so much power. Mistra only knows what they do with their prisoners. Wish I could help you more, but I never heard from Terrace again. What do you know about the Shadow Thieves? It's not an area I keep up with. They run the docks. The man to talk to is called Bloodskull. Word has it they're in some sort of fight right now, but who knows. Hmm, we already had that. You mentioned something about the license? Yeah, sure. The ban on magic casting only applies to the distributable masses. And in M, there's only one barometer for the well to do coin. You've got enough coin, the card wizards are willing to give you the benefit of the doubt. And why not? They get rich, and if you cause a problem, they arrest you anyway. It's not a, bit de not a bad deal, though. Once you've paid them, they tend to ignore you. Try the wizard colony and let the government burn it in the you know, government district if you're interested. Okay, so let's see what he actually has. The to adventure sell. marks the finest shopping in all of favor. Widest selection, lowest prices, and nary a fancy illustration. Just the goods, fair and plain. Yes, there are some items we're interested in. Music to me ears. There's a customer born every minute and the roof sewn after. What it'll be for you today? Hmm. Toodle toodle tum. Nothing to sell here. I'm sticking to the sort of chaos for now, I guess. A lol gem. <laughs> no, it's probably an IO gem. But I always confuse that. Okay, sold it. I probably should hang on to the quarter stuff. At least till I get a better one. Because the stuff of striking that I have has a limited char has limited charges, limited number of charges. And I might hang on to the dagger plus one. Oh we don't need a shot bow though. Bye bye. What do you have to sell? Nothing. What could I buy here then? Um <laughs> a flare plus two. Sling plus two. That's useful. I'm buying that. <coughs> Quarters of plus two. Qu stuff of ruin. It's a, it's a plus four stuff. That's awesome. I want that. Can't afford it though. Ah, probably later. Arrow 
plus bullets plus two, that's cool. Um, started level for you. Short bow plus two, and we already have one. Armor of the Deep Knight. Armor class 3. Hmm. Not half bad. Fortress Shield plus 3. Braces of Defense AC3. Mm, not half bad either. And spells. Ooh, quite a steep one. Rather resurrection. Ah, a gem bag. I want that. Girdle of Hill Giant Strength. Set strength to 19. That's useful too. And I guess that's just what we Ah sold. Done. So you could wear that now. Yeah, it lowers your armor clause a little bit. Give that to her. <coughs> Give that to me. Okay. And we will sell the leather armor. What can we do to make your dreams come true today? We probably won't get much for it though. Yay, one gold coin. <coughs> yeah, better than nothing. Yes, I will do my best. I hope so. Yeah, there are some things, but oh, there are some arrows in there. Greetings, good customer. A pearl to you. <coughs> Deirdre. Greetings adventure, I'm Deirdre. I'm a member of the Aurora's Magic Imperium and have access to her considerable collection of magical treasures. Would you be interested in taking a look at my wares? Sure thing. Um, okay. That's all too rich for my blood right now. Goodbye. Maybe later. Looks. Useless. <coughs> Who's reading all that? Who would you be? Come along. Go ahead. Who are you? Lady Youth. Is it important, peasant? Hello there. I've been watching you since you entered. I suspect you may have need of my wares. What is it that you sell? <coughs> Magic is crawled, illegal of course, which is why I must charge so much for them. Have you no fear of the cowed wizards? Those pompous fools? They are as corrupt as anyone else in the city if you know who to talk to. Now, are you interested or not? Hmm, perhaps you could tell me who to talk to amongst the cowed wizards then, I'd be interested in that. I, I'd imagine you would be. One of the wizards by the name of Cornell decides who gets the license to use magic here. Bring plenty of cloin if you go to see him. You can probably find him in a government building in the government district. Now, would you like to see what I have to offer or not? Sure, let me see what you have. And more spells that we could buy here. <coughs> oh, wait a second, gotta drink something. <coughs> yeah, probably better now. Um okay we need lots of money here and we have a scroll case that's useful. Buy that. Here it is. Now I can store my scrolls in here. Yeah, I don't want a ground actually. Really? I probably just, you know, the ones in the bookcase. Who are you? Lucy. In the sky with diamonds? Somewhat haughtingly. Uh, Lucy 
Turns away as you approach. The Wolfen ignores you. Fine, be like that. I don't like you either. That. I didn't hit the button. Okay. Oh, wrong button. So I guess we're good to go now. Oh, wait. I could give a few arrows to you just to carry them around. Adler's artisans are hell spawn. I care nay a blot. All that matters is the deal, and Ribald's here to make one with you. Yeah, okay then, let's buy something. I forgot. I still need a few bullets. Not many, just a few. That should be sufficient. What is my Let's task? leave. And go to that yes. big circus stand. A Who are you? My mama is still inside. They say she can't come out. What are you talking about, child? My mama went into the tent to see a show, but something happened and now nobody comes out. There are scouts who won't let nobody in anymore too, but my mama is in there. I want my mama. I'll go and see if I can find your mother, alright? Just calm down and be brave. Okay, sir. We must help this child. I will find who took his mother and teach him a thing or three about decency, respect and keeping the hands off of people's parents. Okay. For the glory of arm. Hold. This tent has been closed off for your own safety, citizen. The circus has been closed until the matter is resolved. Why? What has occurred here? We are not exactly sure. There was a problem. There was no problem until the show was scheduled early in the morning. Apparently the show began well enough and then something occurred. Nobody has come out of the tent who went in for the show and everyone we have sent in to investigate has not come out either. Foul magic no doubt involved here is no doubt involved here. We are waiting for the cowl wizards to arrive. They will be able to solve this I'm sure. I can handle myself. Perhaps I can solve this problem for you. Very well then, sir. Uh, I'll not stop you if you wish to risk yourself, citizen. We are you were warned. It is no risk. Not so long as we have swords and braveness to the brim of the tall glass of goodness, right, Boo? We should be careful, eh, would you blow me? There is no telling what is going on within this, within if the city guard can't handle it. Be prepared for anything, is what I always say. On my honor, you must gather your. We can probably take it. Upon stepping through the tent door, the world seems to shift. When it settles, you find yourself standing on one end of a bizarre walkway. As the wind blows over you, a massive tower rises on the other side of the bridge. The tent door is nowhere to be found. You shall have to go forward. Okay. Interesting. Very well. <clears throat> Moving on. Aha! I see a wayfarer has come to Muse Keller. You must answer a riddle naturally, ere I will allow you to pass this bridge. Naturally. Are you ready to hear it? And why would I want to pass over this bridge? Because it is symbolic of your progression to enlightenment and understanding, fool. Are you ready to proceed? I prefer to know who this Kala is before I play any of your games. Kala does not reveal himself to those who are not wealthy. Are you ready to begin? <sighs> Very well, I'm ready. 
Excellent. A princess is as old as the prince will be when the princess is twice as old as the prince was when the princess's age was half the sum of their present age. Which of the following then could be true? Yeah, and before you get out the calculator, it's number 3. The prince is 30 and the princess is 40. Ah, you are correct. The mighty color respects those with a most agile and quick mind. Proceed across with my blessing. And we get 19,500 experience for that. Yay. Okay. You point, <coughs> I punch. Nature's servant away. Where Minsk goes, evil stands aside. Really? Oh, what do we have here? A shadow. Let's kick it. So, for slaying shadows, we get experience. That's not right. Come on. Don't lose critical. That's not critical. right. Thank you. 420 for the shadow. But if we slay the werewolf. Illusion dispelled. There actually was no werewolf here. Boom. What do you require? Done. Get in here. You must gather your party before venturing forth. But the illusion can still hurt you. It's a shame. Who are you? Oh, whoever you are, you must flee this place at once. He's he's killed everyone else who has come into this place. Almost. Oh, please run. How can a monster such as you have such a sweet voice? I I'm not a monster. I'm an elf, a winged elf, or at least I was. This discovering you see is some kind of illusion, but if you believe it in it, then it becomes real. P please believe me. Now go before something happens to you. I beg of you. Mm, who is behind all of this? Who has killed everyone? Keller. Oh, I don't know what he's done exactly or how, but everything here is an illusion. But it's magic that can hurt you if you believe in it. Oh, you probably don't understand, do you? I... I don't know what he's done to the tent or with the others who have come in, but their deaths are real. You must run. I'm not going anywhere until I get a full explanation. Oh, I hope you don't end up like like the others, but all right. My name is Ari. I work in the circus with my uncle, Quail. I don't know exactly what happened, but everything changed a few days ago. Everything became chaos and turned into what you see here. Although it all isn't real, it's an illusion. The minions, they all serve Kella, so I know he's behind all of this. He's an illusionist in the circus, but I don't understand how he was able to do all of this. He must be stopped before he hurts any more people. Please, if, if you release me from my chains, I can help you stop him. Chains? I don't see any chains on you. The chains are invisible, covered by the illusion, and they are magical. They prevent me from casting my own spells and they maintain the illusion which is placed on me. Mm, very well, how do I release you from them? You you need a key for the chains, but but it won't work like a key. There are, there are a couple of commoners on the north side of this chamber. Don't be fooled by the illusion though, they are monsters. They have a sword which is actually my key. If you get it from them, I can remove the chain and regain my normal form. Please be careful, you you can't trust anything you see here. Okay. As you ask. Oh, there's a spider. But it doesn't appear to be hostile. Oh, I am a simple woman. No, you are a simple spider. P please don't hurt me. Oh, what am I to do? You don't seem like any creature I have encountered before. I'm not a creature. Or at least I, I never used to be. Not until the circus and everything changed. Well, who are you then? My my name is Hannah. I came to the circus with my son, although he didn't come into my the tent with me. Oh, please help me. How is it that you became this creature then? I'm not a creature. Wait. We already had that. What exactly is going on here? Oh, I don't know. All I know is that I came into the tent to watch the performance. A gnome came onto the stage and began to perform some kind of magical act. It was quite silly. It was obvious that whatever the gnome was trying to do wasn't working. His magic fizzled and everyone started laughing. I thought it was part of the act, so I laughed too. And then everything began changing. People started transforming into creatures and then back into themselves. 
The world shifted somehow and I felt so sick and horrified. And I think I passed out. When I woke up I had been turned into this... into this... monstrosity. I, I don't know what to do. My son didn't come into the tent with me and I'm frightened to think what may have happened to him. Who are these peasants here? They are, they are not people. They are vicious and dangerous. I've seen them kill people. You must stop them. I'll try. Tell me, do you know where this Keller is? No, I don't. But that woman over there seems to know something about him. Perhaps you've talked to her. Mm -hmm. I think your son is still outside the tent. Wait here. He is? Oh, I will. Oh, thank you. Okay. Let's see what we can do about those peasants. Here are two peasants. They seem to be friendly. Maybe we should talk to them. Oh, wait. It has, uh, it has yes, nothing to say to it us. It shall be. What now? Oh, it attacks. Fine. We can play that game too. What is my task? Fuck you up. On my honor. But I Consider it done. Embarrassing. Oh, he turned into an ogre or orc or something. Like that. What do you require? Embarrassing. Fine. So that was easy. We killed you too. Ding. For the folly! Killed by association. With no, with a scimitar. But still, it worked. And here we have the ogre's sword. An old girl with a woman's voice has asked for the sword, claiming that it will break the illusion cast over her. Oh, we believe that, don't we? Sure thing. Whenever I hear a sweet voice, I always do what it says. Don't you? Doesn't everybody? Okay. You, you had the key. Or rather, the sword. Please, please give it to me, and, and I can be rid of this illusionary form at last. As you wish. I thank you for your trust. The sword, it is actually a key that unlocks the chain that powers my horrible illusion. 18,500 XP. My hands, my skin, it's real again. Oh, thank you, Beavar. Oh, we must find Quail and stop Kala before he does any more harm. And join with us, and we will search for him together in, the, in this place. You would let me join you? Uh, Alright. Come, let's find Quail. Who knows what they've done to him. I think you should know, Ari, that my ultimate goal is to rescue a friend of mine, Imoen, who has been captured by the cult results. It could be dangerous. Oh, I would be glad to help you, truly I would. But we simply must help Uncle Quail first, we must. Yeah, of course, there's no getting out of the tent now. And here we have Ari. Ari is an elf, lawful good, cleric mage. Oh, level 8 cleric, level 9 mage. 400,000 experience points in total. Excuse me, she is very experienced. The most experienced character that we have. Oh no. Ooh. What? Minsk? 487,363? Where did you get that amount of XP? Wow. Okay, but then, Ari. Decent dexterity. Okay, intelligence and okay, wisdom. Let's check her biography. When asked about her past, Ari becomes silent for a time. Obvious saddened by the memory. She lived amongst the Avarial, the winged elves, and was captured by slavers when she was still very young. She shudders when she speaks of her first years in the circus, on display in a cage that restricted her movement to the point that her wings atrophied. They became infected, and Eric can barely speak of the night she was taken out of her cage and her wings were sawn off brutally to keep her alive. She was no longer of use to the circus, and were it not for the kindness of Quail, she surely would have died. He restored her to health and gave her a reason to continue living. And out of respect for his generosity, she learned the devotion of the gnomish god Baron Wild Wanderer. She speaks of Baron with affection, yet still pays tribute to Erdri Fenya. An approaches life outside of the circus with a combination of wild eyed innocence and wonder mixed with an inborn determination to fight against injustice. 
So yes, she had a very bad childhood apparently. And she is very naive. And since she's a lawful good character, she, she really wants to make the world a better place. And that doesn't always work out because she's so naive, but I like her very much. Because, you know, she m somehow she makes me want to protect herself. And I think she is quite useful as a cleric mage. I'm pretty sure she will stay in the party forever. Throughout the whole game. So, we have a ring of wizardry for you, my girl. We also have a dagger. Is that a dagger? Yeah, that is a dagger. And we have a sling and sling stones. So you can actually drop that shit. Oh, yep, she's a cleric. I forgot. No daggers for you. Mm, do we still have the quarter stuff? Yes. Then take that. That means you could probably sell the deck on. <laughs> okay, let's check her spells. Oh, you need. Oh, wait. Do we have any spells? We have a fireball that you could probably use. Uh, wait. Gameplay? Right. And pick up. So, um, no, you. Identify is okay. And a few more magic missiles. I would love to have an armor for you, but you don't know that spell yet. That is. I'm not gonna use that, but the blur will come in handy and the um, master set error again. We don't need that. But the slow is useful and the fireball and a remove magic. A stone skin and a uh, minor globe of invulnerability, I guess that's okay. I don't think we need spell immunity. But now I want you to have a gold monster and a domination, I guess. What a spell. No, I don't need that. Okay, that's cool. Oh, and she already has level 6 spells, contingency and improved haste. Hmm. And she also is a cleric. I don't need a uh, sanctuary. Rather a few more light wounds and an um, armor of faith. That's all cool I guess. You have mm -hmm. four. What do you want then? A silence a uh, whole person. Draw upon holy mind. You have four of that. Then take another one. Oh wait, uh, I don't think we need a uh, resist fire. Take another one of those, and then you can skip that in favor of another whole person. Yeah, I guess that's cool. That's fine, although I'd rather have a... I guess with that, remove paralysis, remove colors, action from fire. Okay, another healing spell then. I don't want the negative plane protection, I'd rather have a protection from evil. And that's pretty much it. Okay, this has been quite a long video, yes. so we're going to take a break here and continue. Oh no, wait, Jahira leveled. We're going to do that too now. Um. Yeah, everything is fine. She got another druid level and a fighter level. That means she gets... Oh, death saving throw reduced by one, wand saving throw reduced by one, polymorph and spell saving throws reduced. 
uh, one level four, one level five spells, and nine hit points. Okay, uh, she can probably learn new spells now too. And I want an iron skins for you. And I guess another healing. Very well. And now we will take a break. So thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye.